Okay, now I'll teach you how to install the driver and the rip software for the machine. Before we before we install the driver, we need to power on the machine as we teach you before. The power on general power switch. And we move the flat bit to the end. Then we click start to power on the top Epson printer. And now we the USB cable is without without connect. And when the start button is stop flashing, it means power succeed. Then we go, we find out, we find out the USB, we cannot get the USB that deliver from focus. And we connect to the printer. And we find out the Volcano Jet support. And first, we install the driver. We find out the driver. And please be sure check the, your, your system of your computer first. Right click my computer and check. It's 64 or, 4 or 32 bit. Here is a 64 volt, 64 bit, and Windows 10. So we must install the this 64 bit driver, and we start to install, accept, and other. Now if we put we put let you to connect the USB cable with the computer. So we find out the USB cable and also we must connect the USB cable from the back side of the machine. We connect the USB cable here. Connect where? And then we also connect add end to the computer. And we automatically to detect the port. And waiting for the driver is install succeed. Then we click OK. And then we go to my computer. Printer, and we find out the port we connect, connect, installed. So this is the Epson driver, and we find out the print property, and see here, all the color is with color. If this all agree with gray color, means not connect, and it show ready. Then we start to set the driver. Right click, print property, and we click by photo. And then the sides, we change to H3 sides. And we click at once. Continue. And we click off high speed. The apply click.
when we finish the driver, we need to test the machine, the motion. So we move the flap bit to the end to check the test the print is okay or not. So we then we go to right click. Then we go to maintenance and we do the not check printing to check the motion. We start click print to check the machine if it starts working and we power on the UV light. So it's in motion and it's working well. It's flashing jet. Then back to the cap station. And the UV light is off. And there's no error light, no error code here. So it means the flap it, the printer is working well. We click finish. So this is step to how to install the driver. After we install the driver, we need to install the RIP software. We find out the RIP software. Right click, left click. We install the Focus RIP version 8.3.2.6. We find out the Focus RIP install file. And here we must uh, pay attention to before we before we install the driver, we need to close all the anti-values software this is the anti-values software we must uh, remove and then we need to click next next and finish After we finish, we need to install the copy the SEC profile to the print to the RIP. We find out the support USB, and we go to RIP software and SEC replacement for profile. We copy this SEC profile. This for collect the color, the printing color. We copy it, and then we find out. The icon, Acro eight two six W. Right click, and I find out installation position. And we go to profile, CMYK. And we copy to this folder. And also default and copy to the to here. After that, we need to connect the USB key. This is the USB. Key. There's nothing on the inside. This is not a USB. It's a lock. It's a key for the loop software. We connect the loop software on the computer. Then we open this RIP icon to open the software, this RIP software.